Hello, hello, hello. Greetings, Lee Shelley and welcome back to another episode of the I Love Lisa Michelle show starring why me, of course, your ladybug. Lisa, Michelle, y'all, today, 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 guess what your girl found? Or shall I say, guess what found your girl? Your girl was getting dressed, took her a long little nap from work, child. Came home straight from work, did a video, took me a little nap, well, no, edited that video. Napped while I edited the video, which is why it was up late at 4 o'clock, 4.30, whatever time y'all saw it on yesterday, on Tuesday yesterday. Your girl took a nap in the midst of it, fell asleep, woke up, took her a good old hot, soaking, soapy, soaking bath, felt good, was squeaky clean, felt clean, felt good, felt energized, got up to do this video, got my, go do a video, didn't know what, and got myself dressed and put my lashes on because I didn't have my lashes on. And guess what came on the tube while I was watching YouTube? My girl KC Connection one year ago came on and it said, it's called, that challenge that she did was called Hence the Blindfold Seafood Challenge that was created, according to the video I saw, was created by my fam, who I love, my girl, Sharika B. I am Sharika B, which is Eating Pretty Mukbang, or formerly known as She Glam TV. And her brother, my brother, is Black BL. BL4CK Denim, his channel, they, they are biologically sister and brother, Sharika and Brian, that's their name, his name, and they are the creators of that challenge. And they tagged my girl, Casey, that what she say in the video. That what she say. And I said, wow, that'd be so easy, Breezy, something to do extra to get the people something to look at besides me not eating just two little, little dry Claws, because they showed them dry, y'all. They're from the other day. Dry claws, dry, just eating all the rice with the B-Lust make delicious. They want to see some extra. So I said, it would be perfect. But the thing is, I just put my lashes on. I said, dang. So, well, I'm going to do it anyway. Even though I got some games here, as y'all saw in my unboxing, some games to start playing with y'all. But anyway, I want to do this. This is from, like I said, one year ago. And my girl, KC, did that. And I got my handy dandy blindfold. It says, uh, it said, good night, child. What that thing say? Oh, this it go this way anyway. It said, good nighty. That, no, good night, child. That what it say. Good night. So, but before I put my blindfold on, child, best of my little wig, little child, I'm going to say my grace over my food and I got water in here. It's water. And we're gonna get to shower down and, and talking, I guess, y'all. It's not time. It's just a blind seafood. I went ahead and added some one time spicy because I'm getting low on my two time. And I have a lot of one time and the three time, the two time, or the what's, what's that? The half a time. Which one's the pink, y'all? That one. Half time, child. Two time, one time, then half a time spicy. I got a lot of that left, child. I'm my two time. I got two whole bottles and I'm getting low. I had 20. Now I'm down to two. So I need to go find out where they got some at before I go to Amazon, child. Because Amazon they went up on the price from what I saw. And your girl is hot. So, again, let me pray over my food and my drink, my water. And we're going to get to putting on the blindfold, blindfold and get to eating, child. Okay. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you, O God, for the food and the drink that you've allowed to be placed before me. I pray, O God, that it will bring nutrients to my body and that it won't cause any hurt, harm, or danger to your daughter in any way. 
In the holy and mighty name of your son, Jesus Christ, I pray and I thank you, oh God, in Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 Y'all, y'all know I'm extra, child. My sister boo says she extra. And I know another lady my age extra. Hey, this is the age of the extra. Child, 50 is the new 30. Okay? I'm 52. I think beloved fought, fought on 45. And I don't know how old my girl Polly is. I, I'm not for sure. I forgot how old my girl KC is. Y'all, we are the new 30. 50, 40 is the new 25, 30. That's what it is. That's what I say it is. Okay, child. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, it's not too tight in my lashes. Because I just did my lashes. And I already sprinkled some of this stuff on my shelf, child. I put it over here, Lord. Y'all, my son was up in there playing a game, video, video, video. He's gaming, but I think he went on the turn the tube off and he left out, shy. But, oh, let me do this while I go. Tell y'all. I got some B-Love smacking licious, licious. I got some cold barred eggs already here. I got some wild marte. I got some lobsters right here that I went ahead and just cut open, child, barred whole. I got some dried out snow crab that I'm going to show up eating I like because it tastes like Remind me of Louisiana Dumbo. I got me some beef sausage right here. Y'all know I love it. I got some cucumber. I got a lemon. I got some uh, 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 some colorful bell peppers right there. No, sweet mini peppers right there. And I said them uh, cucumbers. And I got me some rice, child. Some steamed rice. And it look brown, but it's not brown rice. Even though it can be. I put some ponzu. I sprinkled some lime ponzu sauce on the front of it. That's why it looked this way. That's what it is. I got some ice water right here. A little bit of thing, and I need to get me a big one. Me and my baby get us a big one, child, with our names on it. Well, my full name, the I Love Lee the Michelle Show, and that's what it is. So, I'm about to get started because I'm kind of hot right now. I'm hot in my little studio, studio, which is in my kitchen. Your girl is hot, honey. Let me put this on. And your boy, Corgin, is outside. Catch y'all wondering where he be. He outside in the garage where he loves to be all the time, child. Now, can't see. Sharika and Ryan, this is your challenge. Well, not KC's. I saw my girl KC do a child. This is old. I mean, one year old. See, that's why it's good to have stuff out. See, people still go and do that thing. No matter if it's two or three, four, five years old, people will still go and do that thing. And that's what I'm doing. Wait a minute now. I did tell you I got some my B Love Smack Alicia Spicy Sauce pack right here. I would it is. Let me see. Let me scooch this over just a little bit. Okay, let me see. So I know I have to bring the screen up so y'all can see close up. All right, I'm eating with my hands, but I do have a spoon right here, child. Anyway, let's get started because I am hungry, honey, child. Let me start with, oops, oops. Let me dip this in here. I know I got a sausage in this sauce, child. I hope nothing don't fall off this table. So how y'all doing today, Lee Shelley? Yes. Thank y'all for watching the video, late video on yesterday, Tuesday. Today is Happy Hump Day Wednesday, boom. Mmm, mmm. Mm. Well, what's out? Mmm, mmm, mmm. I got another wet towel somewhere. I can move this on out the way, child, because I never sprinkled you on now. I got something to put my stuff in <clears throat> right there. <coughs> Ooh, what's this? Okay, let me scoot this back. I mean, yeah, it's for me. Mmm. Yeah, she's on my app. What's that? Mmm. Stay out, bitch. Classy, bougie, ratchet. My girl. Why y'all made my my girl Megan the Stallion cry? What y'all did that for? I saw her crying on, on, on the blogs yesterday. Make my girl cry. Y'all know what I, what I realized, what I've been realized. Men, dang, my 
girl sauce and got lukewarm. It's that bad. It was jet piping hot, I thought. Child. Mm. Mm. Men are messy. Mm -mm. That's one thing I've always gave my, my son props on. My son, DeMonte, he has never be missed a child. He had never. My little nephew was young. Even though my son was raised by me, I'm a woman. He wasn't raised by, with his father. He was raised by me for the most part. His dad lives in Louisiana and still does to this day, which is where I'm from. Your baby girl, they're from that boot. That's where I'm from. That's where I'll be. Yeah, I see a little light in me. Okay. I see a little light, but it's, I can't see anything. But, mm. my late nephews, which is my brother's sons or son. They were mainly raised by their mom too. Cause my brother was indisposed for a little while, okay? So, they were mainly raised by my sister-in-law. Uh-oh. But they're younger than my, my son. So they mainly hung around their sister or the cousins, which is mainly girls, my truck, my daughter, Treasure, and the other girls, <clears throat> um, my friend girl's daughter. It was mainly girls, y'all, more girls than boys. Y'all, these snow crabs are dried out, but your girl show finna still do a move on on it. So, yeah, too. So, up here. Hold up, side boy. So, anybody want to do a move on? And they're, they're so embarrassed by how they fool them so skimpy and dried out. Girl, God, I don't want to do that thing. Forget that. Shoot, forget that. People sometimes want to see the real. Mm -hmm. Yes, we know it's more appealing to have it big and light and, and the color all orange and, and everything. But shoot, sometimes, sometimes, you got to call it what it is. Do it how it's going to be. It is what it is. It be what it's going to be. Uh, 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 uh. So, don't let that stop you. Too. You see these influencers, these mookbongers, and I'm one of them, confession, fashion. Up here doing a bowl, a big old bowl of noodles. Child. That we paid 15 cents for. Child, please. Yeah. You might not get the views, but somebody, somebody going to watch you down the line. They're going to watch because everybody's going to be, at some point, especially during this time of pandemic, they're going to be in the same predicament you in. Can't afford to go get no brand new big old lobster tail. Can't go to um, Costco. Can't go to Dango Me. Uh, what's it called? What's it called? The Atlantic, whatever it is. So all your little, little lobster here are not us. You got to try to do what you can do. And bring your personality with you to the table. That's how that's how it is. That's just how it is, honey. Anyway, getting back to what I was saying. Sorry. Mm. Oh. And that's a show that's dry. That's all right. We're going to show them to tear this thing up here. I show you. <coughs> Nose running, child. Y'all know that already. With this sinus and carrying on what I got. Yeah, so nowadays, boys is messy. More messy to me than women. And that's one thing I tell my husband all the time. When I first met my husband, and I was telling him about my, my children, my son was, I think, 13. 
or 14 when he met my son and my daughter Trinity was seven when they met my husband and I used to always tell my pride myself and saying about my son that he was never messy he never participated in mess the, the all of his little cousins and whether it's girls not mama grandma aunties whoever he never did he never did if he was to have seen my husband even when we were dating about town with another chick i told my husband i don't even believe that my son would even tell me probably he might not he might mean he probably would be mad and maybe he, and he may have confronted a boy he may not i don't know car in this, in this case we were dating but he might not either but he might just hold on to the information for a later date i don't know but i say that he's not messy like that my son's never been like that he's never been messy never caught up in what's going on in the family no and you i'd be surprised he knows so and he never would indicate nothing no so I pride my son on that. Because, baby, and my son's 29 now. And he's still like that. But, boo boo, these men now, they 50 cent. All these other men I see on the net, on the gram, and all the rest on the, on the, on the internet. Talking about my girl Megan and things of that nature, child. child. All into female stuff, child. That's something women do. And even nowadays, we don't hardly do that too much. Not women, women. Maybe girls. Child. But they've been tested more than we do. Good Google. Made my girl cry. Look, I don't know if that made her cry. That made her angry. And I don't blame my girl. Megan this day. That's my girl. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Cause she right here from the H town where I be. Um, why y'all, why do people, if they see a big woman, now, now when I say big, I don't mean like fat. Cause fat mean fat, big mean big. I don't mean fat. And statue. Think that she a man. I'm, I remember when I first started watching Wendy Williams, how you do it? How you do it? They used to always think that she say to me that she was a man. They had me convicted. I didn't know she was or not. You know what I'm saying? Well, dang, ain't she? I mean, because you can't tell, really. I used my company here. Must be my husband. But anyway, maybe that's you. Yep. Speak to the Shelly now. Hey, Shelly man. How y'all doing today? Oh, mm, ooh, what y'all doing? Mm. Well, be messy, child. They be messy now that, uh, yeah, but I couldn't tell when I first started watching her, I mean, many years ago. Many, 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 many years ago. What she was until I saw her mom and her dad on her show, which is a uh, Wendy Williams show. Her mom and her dad came on the show and they showed a picture a picture of Wendy when she was a little girl with her little pigtails. And she's just tall. That's all like an Amazon. Just like made the thing. Beautiful. What? My thing is, even if she is, even if, even if she do have something down now, what they got to do with you? You ain't got to worry about it. You know, talking about that's why she got shot in the foot. Oh boy, Tory Lanez. That's what they did. What they say? Not me. This is a disclaimer. This is allegedly what that. But this is what I heard for sure on the blog that that's why he probably shot in the foot. Allegedly, because they saw she saw it down there that she had a third leg and he was mad. Oh my gosh, child! I guess, I guess negativity. Well, I know negativity sells, but it's always at somebody else's expense. You know? I don't know. I 
just think that stuff come back to, you know, you can be, you can have fun to a certain extent, I think. But not when it's, mm, for me, not when it's against somebody. I make a joke that's about like an animal or a fiction, a person that's fiction. Not a person that's real, you know, that they can ever come across my video. I don't care how small my channel could be at the time when I do it and, you know, be offended by it or get, and getting their feelings by it, you know, somebody, you know, I don't, I don't ever want to be like that. I just don't. Even in my personal life, I just don't want to do that, you know. People don't care sometimes. And they say stuff behind people back and think that they ain't going to get back to the person they're talking about, but I just think that's not good, you know. It ain't good. When you mature and you know that the universe, as they say, well, in my case, God sees and hears everything that you do, no matter if you think you're doing it in the dark, it comes back to it comes back on you some type of way. You get that back. Karma, as they say, karma. So why would it be, would it behoove you to talk about people, even if you think it's so you think you think it's so slightly so oh that's nothing that's so mediocre. And that's what the devil wants you to think that's mediocre. You can lose your blessing. He wants you to think it's mediocre. Oh, it ain't nothing. Ain't nobody gonna be affected, worried about that, affected by that. But you don't know that. You won't want them out doing it to you. Oh, I can handle it. That's, that's, I'm big and back and handle it. But over time, will you be able to? If everybody did that to you, if everybody said to put their mouth on you, would you? And even if you, even if you would, but I mean, so what if you can't? That's not good to do. That's not good to do that. Well, you might come. It might be a time in your life where you might not be as strong as you think. Child, honey, boo boo. And my little Nisty Pooh, Meg, Megan, the stallion, say, she don't give a dang on about y'all, even though she probably it might hurt her feelings, you know, make, make her sad. Because we human. We know a dang on robots. When stuff don't affect us, it might not affect us like, you, like a person would want it to. But it affects us a little bit to some degree. Excuse me, y'all, for wiping my nose. I apologize. It does. Shoot. Child? But who is that? Demonte? Cardine? No. Oops. But yeah, child, it just, it just, I just was so sad to hear, see her cry, her little life. She was so pretty, though, so cute. You know, and just because you are a makeup star or you begin to be famous and the whole world knows and chants and calls your name, child, don't mean that your feelings are, that you hard. You know, you might get hard over time because once you're in that type of business, you realize that people, most people don't mean no good. That's just, that's, that's just in life, period. Well, even if you big or small, it's just a lot of times people have ill intentions. They want something from you. Seem like, you know. That's just so unfortunate. That's why you got to be very proper and ask God to surround you with people who love him, who have a mindset of him. Even family sometimes. I have ill intentions sometimes. Co-workers and all that other stuff. But you got to not do that. Because I believe that what you put out, you get back. That's what I believe. And that's what they call karma. I believe that what you put out, you you get back a boomerang effect. It come right back to you at some point. I don't care if it's right then or later down the line. It's going to come back to you. You're going to remember. Child, God got a way of bring that, back, that thing back to you, child, when you least expect it. When you old, tired, gray, you're out of gas, child. Child, yeah. When all your uh, hip hop and hippity hop, hip. Huh? And all that stuff out of day, all that stuff is out of gas, child. When you done tired and laid, and laid it on down, he got a way to bring that stuff right back then, child. When you done been, been stopped cutting up, you didn't ask the girl for forgiveness, you didn't change your lifestyle, child. That's how it is. For the most part, when you changed and doing right and have been doing right for a long time, then sometimes if you see all that back pain, all that karma, all that it come back on you then it seem like that's what I've experienced. 
So you don't want that stuff to come upon you, you know? You put out good things. So you know that you'll be receiving good things back. Even if you receive bad things in the midst while you're waiting for your blessings to come, I wouldn't be affected by those bad things that come because those things are only to strengthen you to make you better. But if, you, if you've been putting out good energy, good vibes, and sowing good seed, and I mean really sowing it, you'll know if you're in your heart, and you act like you're sowing it, and you really ain't. But if you know in your heart and your spirit that you've been good, um, doing good, and have good intentions behind what you're doing, in your heart, your mind, child, I wouldn't worry about a thing. No matter when, no matter if the devil brings bad things my way, I know that before in a minute, I'm going to have an abundance of blessings coming, child. An abundance. It might not be the blessings I want. It might not be no big old fancy house. I might not be no millionaire. I might not have all the stuff I want to have. But, child, my health, my strength, my kids, my family, health and strength, my peace, that surpasses all understanding, all those things, child, that we sometimes overlook. And we take for granted. Those things will be in my life and I'll be just fine, child. Things that won't cause me to gray or age so quickly. I have wrinkles in my, on my side of my eyes and my forehead and every which way. Well. Child, I'm 52. When I see people my age, I mean way younger than me, looking like they're older than me. Because they make those things stressful. Lack of peace, child. I know about that peace, a lack of it. I know about that, child. Uh-oh. Well, I was glad to see my little sissy poo on that, on the um, live stream. But, I was sad to see her cry tears and stuff, so. Only God knows what really happened. At the party, the pool party, the general house, wherever there was that child. Only God knows about what happened, who really shot on her foot. If it was both feet, if it was glass, if it wasn't glass. If it was a best friend, if it wasn't. If it was Tory Lanez, if it wasn't. If it was Kylie, if it wasn't. Or whoever, whatever. If there was arguing, if they wouldn't. If she was jealous, of, if she wouldn't. If he was mad, if, she, if he wouldn't. However, whatever, child. Only God knows. And whenever they want to tell her, they will. And that's it, that's all. And now I'm full, child. I am full, child. Yes, I am. And I'm gonna pull this blindfold off my eyes, honey, child, boo boo. Sometimes I wish I could eat like I used to before I had my surgery. Baby, I can tear that food. If you hear me, I can tear it up. I remember I used to be at the restaurants, y'all. Try if my lashes stuck to it, to my, to my, to my lid, to my eye. Child. I know something I'm sweating, though. Whew. I remember when I first had my little surgery, y'all. You know, before I had my surgery, I can tear up some food. We used to go to, I used to go to a Chinese restaurant. Love to eat Chinese food, and I still do today. Rice, because it's rice, y'all. And some shrimp. Child, used to sit there. I used to be there for hours, honey. Eat a whole lot of food, and then sit there till I got about an hour and 30 minutes or whatever till I got to hungry for some more. Confession, confession. This is my confession. Your girl ain't lying. That's what I used to do. That's what I used to do. And that's for true. That is the truth. So, y'all, I still got a lot of these old dry snow crab shy, but I'll probably eat on this off camera, child. Because that ball ain't nothing of too much in them besides a little dry piece of meat, child. That probably won't even do like this here when I when I shake it, child. But I'm going to still eat it, though. Your girl going to still eat it, child. Yep, 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 yep. So, y'all, I did eat one egg. Look like I ate one egg. And probably, I don't know what else. I know I ate a sausage too. And I ate a lot of rice, look like. And I'm full. As y'all already know.
And I'm sweating. Look at me sweating, child. What the? Anyway, y'all, y'all keep my girl Megan the Stallion in your prayers and all, everybody who's involved in this situation, her bitch friend, Tori, everybody who got something to say, pray to God and shut their mouth up. Just hush up. You don't know this hush. Shoots. That you got something positive and constructive and, and lifting and encouraging to say, child. Come on, men. Be quiet, men. Men, what's wrong with y'all? What is the matter? All of a sudden, y'all got to go... Worse than a female. Good, Google it. Yes, I need to get my son praise for that because I just, he just never, I, he's never been like that. Never. Never. And I'm not saying because he's my son. He's in heaven. He's in, I, I always say that if I can't say nothing else, I can definitely say that he has never been the type that's been in the family business, no one was going with the family, run, go tell the, the sister, which is treasure his sister, go tell me, mom. He, I mean, he's just never been like that. He should never have. And, and, and I used to always say, dang, my son is so nonchalant. Yeah, you know. He is kind of, he don't really, you know, he don't get off in that type of stuff. He just don't. He just don't. With other, also my other little cousins, my other little nephews, be all in. But then he don't. And I be thinking he'll be knowing stuff, but he do. That's why I say, well, really? You know? But anyway, y'all. Your girl fool, y'all. That's just a little side eye, boy. Your girl is full. Y'all go check out. The, this is an old challenge. Like I say, I saw it. YouTube put it in my on my TV. As I was getting myself ready to do a video. Child, I got taco over here, Taco Bell and everything. Yeah, I was going to do. Child. And I'm still going to do. But, uh, put that in my spirit. This is old. I said, let me go eat that first. And I said, well, let me go do that. Because my husband, knew he was actually, he was went to the store. But he didn't want to record today. He was saying he was tired. He cut the grass. It was tired, child. So I didn't worry him, but your girl gonna take care of what she got to do. And so I needed something to do. And the Holy Spirit put that on my on my TV. And uh, 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 I watched my girl do it as I was getting dressed. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that there. And I love me some Ricky Sharika B and Black Denim. So yeah, they are the creators of this challenge. This is a, this is a very old challenge. It said one year ago, child. About be almost two years, probably. I don't know. But it said one year. So y'all check it out. It's called the Blindfold. Seafood Challenge. That's what it's called by Sharika B and Black Denim. And I saw my girl KC Connection. Hey, my connector. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. Join the family if you like good food. It's a place to be. Come have a little fun with your girl KC. What's up, my connectors? Welcome back to the channel. Yeah, I know how she does, my girl. That's who I saw her do it, y'all. So anyway, y'all don't forget to like comment and share share on every social media platform and subscribe so that you 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 and you and you and everybody too can become an official please show in and ding don't no, ding don't forget to hit that notification bell i said now don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you can be reminded of Every, every time your girl uploads a video, okay? And be quick with it. La, 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 la,